wind feels like needles on my face. I have on these goggles to protect my eyes. And if you look here, you can see that this uh, sign is just flapping back and forth. Well, right now we're here on Hutchinson Island. I'd say about 14 miles south of Fort Pierce. And if you take a look behind me, you can just see the rough seas, the waves pounding the shoreline. And they're moving in. They're about 30 yards inland compared to, I'd say, about three hours ago, increasing the potential threat of a storm surge and coastal flooding to the low lying areas. There's a mandatory evacuation for people who live in mobile homes, uh, low lying areas, and the barrier islands, including Hutchinson Island. I'm now joined by Sunny Weatherman, uh, no relation to the Weather Channel, by the way. Uh, you were evacuating with your wife. Tell me about your concerns. Well, we are the caretakers of two very elderly ladies, and had it not been for them, we would have possibly thought about maybe staying. Uh, however, we can't take a chance of putting those ladies or ourselves in harm's way of this serious hurricane. Now, Sonny, you and your wife also evacuated during Hurricane Francis. Here we go again. Deja vu. You're now evacuating again for Hurricane Jean. How does that make you feel? Tired, completely worn out, uh, anxious for th things in life to get back to normal. But you have to take what comes if you want to live a good life. And you were telling me that this is just an awfully unusual hurricane season. You've been living out here for years. I've lived out here for almost 20 years, and I've never seen a hurricane season like this and hope to never see one again. Well, I want to thank you on behalf of the Weather Channel for joining us. Have a safe trip to Naples and southwest Florida where you can stay out of the path of potential path of Hurricane Gene. You heard it from Sunny Weatherman.